Hey, what's going on, True 10? Hey, man, I came to talk to y'all about this work. I seen Gilly talk about this shit in Wallow, and I uh, I think it was Gilly Wallow and the nigga Brent. Uh, they said, do money. They said, does money work without, does a relationship work without money? It does. Does a relationship work without money? It does. It really does, bro. It just depends on the scenario who the woman is, my nigga. Like, bro, some bitches is just driven by reward. That's like a, that's like a, that's like, I think that's really the most generation that we live in. It's like a lot of us is driven by reward, you know? But it all depends if you got a general, a, a general, a, a genuinely loving woman. You did what I'm saying? Like, she knows, she know for a fact. Like, I know Walla was like, yeah, but you got to buy her stuff, you know? Buy her the shoes she want, clothes. It without the finances, like buy her jewelry, clothes, jewelry, uh, TVs, houses, di different shit. Whatever the fuck she want, Gucci bags, such and such. That's a woman that's driven by reward, my nigga. That's a bitch who just in a relationship with a nigga because she want money. But honestly, bro, it's plenty of niggas in the world you can get that from. Now let me tell you something about a man. If a woman, uh, uh, let me not gonna say you know, I'm gonna say I ain't gonna even say a man. I'm gonna say a woman. Let me tell you something about a, a like a woman. A woman, bro, she knows that you may not have all the finances in the world, but she know you're working towards them situations. She, a lot of, I, I just heard this shit to where now women don't want to build up with you. They want to come in where you are, come in already where you already have your kingdom and you already have your shit built. But let me tell y'all niggas something. Let y'all, let me let y'all really think for a minute. Just because you already had your kingdom and a bitch come into it, that don't mean she's the right woman for you. She may be coming to your kingdom to fuck your kingdom up, bro. See, see, it's a two-way street, my nigga. It ain't always about having your kingdom built. Some women that come in your life to build your kingdom, and some women that come in your life to just come in your kingdom and fuck it up. You already may have a kingdom, but she coming in fucking that motherfucker up. See, every bitch, you got to watch the type of women that you around, my nigga, and watch the type of women you looking for. Because every nigga got a different ca caliber of women that they attract, and... I learned that shit too. When you stay focused on yourself as a man, bro, the women that you attract, you will no longer attract no more. That's the truth. That's that's the that's the motherfucking truth. Like no no bullshit. Like that's the truth. I know this. I know this one thing about life, and this is the crazy part. Does relationships work without money? Does love work work in a relationship without money? It does if a woman generously care about you. It does, bro. Like it really does. If she if she got that mind frame to where she she thinking about no other nigga but you, she ain't that type of materialistic woman. She don't give a fuck about all that shit. As long as she know that your love is there and you always there for her mentally and you always there for her physically and spiritually, she care about everything you got going on. That's the woman to have, my nigga. Yes, it does matter. Yes, money. Of course, a man wants money in a relationship, but I'm saying it's a lot. It's a lot of couples out here, even from back in the day, to where they didn't have it all. Like the man didn't have it all, but she stayed with him through it, or she helps him build himself up. Like I say, behind a great man is always a great woman. You dig what I'm saying? So does that shit work? It does. It will always work. No bullshit. It would always work. That's why I tell people, man, understand everything ain't just about. The materialistic, if a, if, a, if a woman is driven by, if a bitch, anything just driven by materialistic shit, she's not a grown woman. She's not a woman who think about mental healthy things. She don't care about her man. All she care about is money and dollars and rewards and shit, what you can do for her. She's not thinking about what you, uh, thinking about you or what you, or what's, or what you got going on in your life. She don't give a fuck about none of that. She just give a fuck about what you can do for her. And that's majority of these bitches nowadays. They are so driven by reward. You dig what I'm saying? They're driven by reward. And that's why. That's why you have to pay attention, fellas, because every woman, just because you got a kingdom, don't get this shit twisted. I tell niggas all the time, it don't, you got to make sure the woman is right for you, bro. Don't be, don't move off impulse. Don't, don't get the, don't get the just doing shit because it's cool to do. The girl may look good. That's one thing I heard. Men fall in love with their eyes. Women fall in love with their ears. But in the reality, a lot of that shit be fake either way. You dig what I'm saying? A lot of us, a lot of us men pull women from what we say from what we say to them and a lot of women pull up and when a lot of women pull us from what we're looking at we may see ass and titties and that may be the most attractive thing to us but that also will be so fucked up either some of us don't look at the face we care about that shit but any woman who can have ass and titties bro and still be slow dig what i'm saying they still ain't got the right caliber of a woman in them you gotta understand i heard i heard uh andrew, uh, andrew tate say some shit like this too Salute to that man too, man. You know, I think they tried to ban him or whatever too, but this is some real shit he said. He said, man, a woman who's a woman who's 19 has way more value than a woman who's 25 and 40 or older. He said, you want to know why? It's because that woman ain't been through too many dicks as the 25 or the or the 
the fucking 40 year old has you dig what i'm saying because what you don't understand bro it's so many soul ties with that and you're not the only nigga she thinking about and that's the truth and that's the truth bro does love work without money it does bro because of a woman a queen like like i, I seen him say some shit too like you may be a guy that got all the money and got and got all the money and all the bitches but guarantee you them two bitches right there don't care about you and you may have all the money in the world but i know them two bitches right next to you don't care about you but i know i know you may have more money than me the nigga may have more money than me or the next nigga but i know these two queens on my side actually care about me them women right there only use you for what the fuck you have but the, but i i got money but these two queens right here care about me for actually being the man that i am dig what i'm saying so does love work without money Yes, it does. It just depends on what woman is down for you because it's kind of hard to find out in this generation because of what goes on. You know what I'm saying? The internet, the internet fucked up a lot of this shit because we women are more so driven by what a nigga can do for them versus what they can do for the man. Because if you could, any nigga can find a woman that can cook and 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 fucking give pussy up. Let me tell y'all something. Another thing about another thing about love though, bro, and this relationship shit. When it come to sex, bro. A lot of you women don't understand, bro, using these sex toys, bro, and, and love, period. Like, you, you, you don't realize, like, some men don't give a fuck about, they, they care about sex. They, they care about a person when soul ties become an a intimate situation, when it's actually something to soul tie about. Like, the end of the day, a lot of you women don't understand when y'all using these sex toys, it's opening y'all up, it's, de it, it's decirculating y'all. Like, women got to learn how to control themselves with sex as, as just as a man do. You dig what I'm saying? They, they always say... They always say a man who go out and has sex with motherfuckers, he, he don't value himself. And that's that's true too. It go both ways. A woman who go out and has sex with just plenty of different plenty of different niggas, she devaluing herself. Like her value is not there no more because she let every man through it. So does love work without money? It does. If it's meaningful, if it's truthful, and if it's there to be there, it does mean something. Yeah. Peace. Follow me at actual truth on this girl. Follow me at TG.true. Like, comment, subscribe to actual truth. Peace.